John Murray, Superbook director, joining us from Las Vegas. Some big spreads this week, man. 18 and a half, 15 and 12 and a half in the Super Contest. How do these numbers get so high? Well, we have to eventually write a bet on an underdog, Sam. I mean, it'd be nice to occasionally see an underdog get bet, maybe even win a game for once. Did have one guy we respect, thought we were too high on Arizona Houston. He took 18 and a half with Houston last night. We're at 17 and a half now on the board. It was a good week for us on this segment last week. I had the Colts. You had a wire to wire winner on the Minnesota Vikings. Your guy, Mike Zimmer, never makes it easy, apparently. But I'm curious about the number this week on New England. Tough loss, tough non cover against the Dallas Cowboys. Patriots minus seven against the Jets. Hmm, I wonder where the action's at. Nice shout out there. Wire to wire winner in overtime on the Vikings. Uh, yeah, everybody's betting the Patriots. It's a tough spot for the Patriots. That was an emotional game against Dallas. They certainly should have covered, probably should have won. And now everybody's betting them against the Jets this week. The Jets off of a bye. About 10 to 1 right now. New England, take a count. A little less than 10 to 1. I'll go first here. I like the Bengals getting six and a half. That's my number in the contest, at least. I like that against Baltimore. It's crazy. Baltimore has eked by in so many games, including, John, a long field goal, like a 78 million yard field goal against the Detroit Lions. We forget about that because the Ravens have played well as of late. I think this number is too big. Divisional game. Give me the points with the Bengals. Super contest line is six and a half. We're down to six on the board at the Superbook. Saw some sharp money take the Bengals last night. So if you're betting at the Superbook right now, the line six, the contest number six and a half. And you love the bet, it sounds like. I like it. I like the, I love a big fan of Joe Burrow. Joe Burrow, there's so many great young quarterbacks in the AFC right now. We're, we're going into this golden generation with Mahomes and Allen, Herbert and Jackson. But don't forget about Joe Burrow. All right, Mr. Murray, you're five and one on these plays on Nesson.com. Who do you like in week number seven? A lot of pressure, but I'll go the Philadelphia Eagles plus three. Eagles get three extra days to prepare for this game. They had the Thursday night game against Tampa last week. A lot of Eagle fans are going to be at Allegiant Stadium on Sunday. Believe me, I know. My family used to have Redskins season tickets, and the Eagles fans are always ones to travel. I think they win this game on Sunday afternoon against the Raiders. He's John Murray from Las Vegas. Thank you, sir. You got it.